This is a drawing of a fireman putting out a fire. We're going to start with the arm right about here. And it goes like that. And then up a little higher from here, draw arm. And then a curve line here for the hand. And there's a thumb. And then this curves like that. Next we'll draw the hose. So from the hand, draw the hose like this. With the nozzle on the top. And then imagine where it's going to come out. It goes behind his arm and off the side of the page. And the same with the bottom of the hose. Right here, we draw four bumps, and those are the fingers. And then right up here is the thumb where he's holding it. Right next to the thumb, draw a line. And then this is the other arm that goes up. And stop right there before you get to this elbow corner. Stop this one. Actually, it can go a little further. Then there's a line that goes up. And then a V-shape. This drawing is a little tricky, so you might have to try it a couple times. And then this line goes out to about the end of this, see? And then it comes in and goes out and around and down. <coughs> and then it comes down over a little bit and then right about here under this point is where the front of the jacket comes down. So that's his jacket and he has stripes. One, two, three stripes here and here. One, two, three, and then here and here. One, two, three. Also, some stripes here. One, two, three. <clears throat> and then down at the bottom of his jacket. Okay. Now, for his face. This part is also a little tricky. So, it comes out of this side. And his chin goes up and then out for his lip. And then it goes in and out for his mouth. Up just a little. Curved up just a little. And then back. And then up for his forehead. And now his hat comes over like this, a big curve. And then it goes out past the back of his jacket. And then up. The front goes up and down. And this comes in like this. On the front, there's like a half oval shape. Draw a little line for the back of his head and two lines for the strap on his hat. And for his eye, you can draw a sideways V and then a little rounded eye there. For his legs, they're just simple rectangle shapes that go, one goes out this way and up, and the other one comes out this way 
And you want to make sure that they're pretty much the same length. And there's stripes on the bottom. Three stripes. And then his feet. This one is flat on the ground. This one is just got the toes on the ground. That. <clears throat> Okay, now out of the hose, there's water coming out like that, and then some more water. Coming out with some drips off to the side like that. And coming right out of the water out of the side is the bottom of the window and then there's three big flames coming out of the window that go behind the water then you can imagine straight up where the rest of the window would come out and then come down behind the water Right, right about in the middle of these two points is where the window pane is. And the lines on the window, there's one, two going this way, and two going down, like that. Right over here, we're going to draw the side of the building. Just comes straight down behind the fireman and then stop right about there, right about the middle of his jacket. And then draw a bush that is in front of the house or the building, like that, with some leaves shapes. In the background there's some more bushes. So just draw a line like that and then some big lines like that with smaller leaves because it's farther away. So here's mine colored. <clears throat>